My new book is the Little Black Book of Connections. It's filled with provocative secrets and clues to help you with all of your connection questions, like these. How can I earn the respect of a powerful person without begging? Here's the secret. If you schmooze, you lose. And here's the clue. People who keep up with current affairs so they can have something to talk about have nothing of substance to talk about. If you're trying to make a genuine connection, have something of substance to say. Then, say it with confidence, in a way that the other person is compelled to think and respond. How can I turn a contact into a relationship? Here's the secret. Do for them before you try to take from them. And remember, in order to do for someone, you have to do something. So here's the clue. Doing it is something that most people, not you of course, are going to do as soon as they can get around to it. What a bunch of crap that is. If you want to make a connection, do something for someone now. How can I connect with powerful people? Here's the secret. Follow my rule of drool. Here's the clue. Don't slobber. Most people make the fatal mistake of trying to push their way or sell their way or drool their way to a connection. What really works? Try this. Ask nothing for yourself. Be willing to just walk away. So, what do you want? Access to someone powerful? More clients? More money? How about a big piece of chocolate cake with ice cream on it? My personal promise to you is once you've read my little black book of connections, making connections will be simple, and getting what you want, that's gonna be a piece of cake, a big piece of chocolate cake with ice cream on it, maybe a cherry, and uh, if your contacts are anything like mine, maybe even a couple of nuts. <laughs>